Welcome back to Tech News Saturdays here on Tech Tomorrow, your go-to weekly roundup of the biggest stories in tech. This is episode 15, and today we've got some truly groundbreaking developments that are set to reshape the future. From quantum computing as a potential solution to AI's looming energy crisis, to Meta's game-changing AI-powered video generator, this is an episode you won't want to miss. So, grab a seat, get comfortable, and let's dive into the tech world. Before we dive into the world of news, make sure to check out our community posts. We will be posting information about a contest giveaway once we surpass 350 subscribers. To be qualified, subscribe to the channel and make sure you like, comment, and share this video and future videos for a chance to be selected at random for our giveaway. One Quantum Computing, the answer to AI's energy crisis, our first story is one that could change the future of AI as we know it. AI technology has been making leaps and bounds, but one major obstacle threatens to slow down its progress, energy consumption. According to a report from Forbes, AI models like GPT-4 and others are guzzling more electricity than ever before, particularly during the training phase. The energy costs of these models are skyrocketing, with data centers using enormous amounts of power just to keep AI systems running smoothly. But this is where quantum computing comes in. Quantum computing, unlike traditional silicon-based systems, doesn't rely on binary bits but quantum bits or qubits that can exist in multiple states simultaneously. This allows quantum computers to process vast amounts of data far more efficiently. While traditional AI models require enormous amounts of processing power and thus energy to crunch through data, Quantum computers can solve those problems exponentially faster while consuming much less power. The implications are profound. If quantum computing continues to develop at its current rate, it could soon provide a solution to the AI industry's energy crisis. Imagine AI models that are not only exponentially smarter, but far more eco-friendly. Energy efficient AI systems could be used in everything from climate change modeling to healthcare diagnostics without placing such a burden on the grid. However, we're not quite there yet. Quantum computing is still in its early stages and faces significant hurdles before it becomes commercially viable. Still, the promise of a greener AI future is too big to ignore, and companies worldwide are racing to make this a reality. Two, simulating the universe. Quantum computers create cosmic models. If quantum computing solving AI's energy crisis didn't blow your mind, this next story will. According to the Quantum Insider, quantum computers are now being used to simulate the very building blocks of the universe. Researchers have successfully used quantum computing to model the creation of particles, mimicking processes that occurred just moments after the Big Bang. This feat is no small achievement. Conventional computers simply don't have the computational power to simulate the incredibly complex interactions between particles in the early universe. Traditional methods would take years, if not decades, of processing time to run these calculations. But quantum computers have changed the game by allowing scientists to model these interactions in a fraction of the time. What does this mean for the future of science? Well, these simulations could help researchers unlock some of the most profound mysteries of the universe from understanding how matter formed to probing the very nature of space and time. The possibilities are limitless. The ability to simulate the universe on a quantum level could also lead to breakthroughs in fields like particle physics, material science, and even cosmology itself. As quantum computers get more powerful, we may soon witness a new age of scientific discovery that redefines our understanding of the cosmos. Three Meta's AI video generator Sora takes content creation to new heights switching gears to the world of AI and content creation. The Verge recently reported that Meta has launched an AI-powered video generator called Sora. This new tool is poised to revolutionize the way creators, marketers, and everyday users produce videos. The premise is simple. Users can input a text prompt and Sora will generate a video based entirely on that description. While AI-generated images and text have already made waves across industries, video creation has always been far more complex. But with Sora, the technology has reached a new level. By using generative AI algorithms, the tool can create everything from short clips to more sophisticated stylized videos, 
saving hours of production work. This will make professional quality video creation accessible to virtually anyone, regardless of skill level. This innovation is set to impact multiple industries, advertising, entertainment, social media, and beyond. Want to create a cinematic trailer for your business? Just type a description and let Sora handle the rest. Want to craft a quick explainer video for a product launch? No problem. As AI-driven content creation continues to advance, it's clear we're entering a new era where anyone can become a video creator. However, this also raises ethical concerns, particularly regarding deepfake technology and AI-generated content's potential for misinformation. As these tools grow more powerful, the line between real and AI-generated content becomes harder to discern, which means regulation and transparency will be more important than ever. For Microsoft's HoloLens, to discontinuation, a new AR era begins. Lastly, we move to the realm of augmented reality AR. Microsoft has made headlines by discontinuing its HoloLens 2 AR headset, as reported by The Verge. HoloLens 2 was once considered the cutting edge of mixed reality, blending the physical and digital worlds in ways that were revolutionary for industries like education, healthcare, and even defense. So why discontinue it now? The decision may signal a shift in Microsoft's focus. Although HoloLens 2 is no longer in production, the company is far from abandoning augmented reality. Instead, this could indicate that Microsoft is pivoting to a more software-centric approach, possibly integrating its AR technologies into everyday devices like smartphones, laptops, or other wearables. HoloLens 2's impact can't be understated. It introduced AR to industries in ways that made real-world tasks easier and safer, from medical procedures to virtual team collaboration. Now, Microsoft may be rethinking how to deliver augmented reality to a broader audience. The future of AR is still unfolding, but it's safe to say that while HoloLens 2 is going away, the vision of AR at Microsoft is far from over. And that wraps up another episode of Tech News Saturdays. Today, we delved into quantum computing's role in solving AI's energy crisis, explored how scientists are using quantum systems to simulate the universe, discovered Meta's new AI-powered video generator, and reflected on the end of Microsoft's HoloLens 2. As always, the world of technology is moving at lightning speed, and we're here to keep you up to date with all the latest developments. Thank you for tuning in to Tech Tomorrow. Don't forget to like this video, stay tuned to our community page, comment down below, smash that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell for more updates on the latest in tech. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring this vast world of tech tomorrow.